All right, welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Sons of the Forest. Hope everybody's having a great day. Uh, the reason why I got this screen up is because I spawned into that bunker, and even when you're in the bunker or you're in the pause menu, like the music still plays, and it was just really, really loud, and I wanted to be able to hear myself think. But uh, welcome back, everybody. Um, I appreciate all the love, all the likes, new subscribers that you guys have been showing uh, to this Sons of the Forest series, and uh, I'm excited to be back into it. I know a lot of people have been asking about it uh, yesterday, uh, but here we are. We are back. We're going to be continuing our survival. Uh, last episode, we did a lot of exploring. Um, I hit a bunch of caves, and uh, today we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go back to base. I'm going to get you know some food, stuff like that set up. Um, I do plan on building an out like an exterior wall. I might even I don't know. I'm still not even 100 percent sure that's where I want to stay. Uh, but for right now, we are gonna head back to base. I'm gonna rearm, you know, get all my new supplies and stuff like that, and then uh, we're gonna head back out and uh, hit some more. Now that I got the shovel, I can dig up some more of those uh, underground tunnels. I did get the key card too, um, so I can open some of them key card doors. And uh, yeah, yeah, we're gonna be going from there. So um, there it is. Let's uh, get this back up. Uh, so, I was making some arrows. Um, some of these resin arrows. I'm gonna make a few more of these things. Gotta look for the shotgun. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I plan on trying to find out. I, I don't know where it is exactly, but... Uh, we got a lot of POIs that could still hit. I needed the shovel for quite a few of them, so... We'll be going from there. Oh, there's actually three key cards? Oh, shit. Well, I found one. <laughs> uh, will I be playing Ark? Yeah, Ark will be being played after this game later on tonight. I don't know how many arrows I can hold. Threat 20 3D printed. Okay, so 20 is max. Kind of stinks. Uh, alright, well, I raced it a little resin. I don't know if those will stay there, but... Let's head out. Actually, what time is it? Hmm. It's kind of crappy, but we'll, we'll, uh, we'll pop an energy bar. We're, like, dead tired, and, uh, it's only, like, middle of the day. So we'll pop an energy bar, just enough to get us back to base. Uh, have I ever played Undisputed? No, I have not. Let me see if I can change the, uh... Hate controls on games that make you reach across your keyboard. And to turn my light on, I gotta reach across and hit L. Uh, I'd rather just switch it to F, because I don't think F is keyed to anything in this game. Yeah, yeah, we'll leave it F. Yeah, it's right there. I don't have to reach across my keyboard. I'm from uh, New York. Okay, so we're gonna do scout around here really quick. Oh, I forgot about you, Kelvin chat. Alright, we're full on sticks. Alright, we're gonna grab Kelvin. We're gonna have him follow us back home. Make sure he's following. You good? Our base is really close by. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try it one more time, guys. We're gonna we're gonna give our pointless ass thousand re resin sled a shot here. Really? Yeah, this river doesn't really run very fast.
Oh shit. Trying to ign uh, bypass some conflict if we don't have to. Can you hand items to Kelvin? I don't know. I, I'm actually going to test that out today. People said that you can switch. Um, but he doesn't give you that. Uh, take item. Yeah, people were saying that you could rotate the, the menu. But with Kelvin, I, I don't see how that how you do that. Like it changes clothes. But I don't see how you rotate the, the menu. Pushing all the buttons, chat. Pushing Q, E, R, F, G, T. G just closes. We'll get back to base, though. Yeah, I was hitting Q and R. And neither of them did it. Only thing is when I did that I didn't middle mouse button? I don't know, I'd have to try. He's not following me right now, so I gotta get him to follow me again. I'll try middle mouse. Nope. Nope. Uh, before I give Virginia a gun, I got to make sure I have a, I have another one. You know what I mean? I don't want to give her my only handgun that I... It's my go-to weapon right now. What is the greatest mobile game? Uh, I'm not huge on mobile games. The only one I really play, like, all the time would be, like, Clash of Clans or, like, Clash Royale. Almost back to base. I haven't tried to give her the GPS tracker yet. Now I see, I see a lot of people saying uh, to give it to her. I, ha I haven't tried to do it yet. All right, we are back home. All right, we'll tell Kevin to go do some fishing. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'll have him do it over here. So I'm going to tell him to drop it right in front of our racks. We'll have him drop the fish here. Hey, where are you going? Oh, I think he was probably going to get a drink. My bad, dude. We're going to tell him to get fish. And drop here.
So hopefully we don't have an attack or anything coming in soon. I do got to figure out how I want to... How I want to build, uh, like, a defensive wall here. Uh, but it is going to be expen or it is going to be a pain in the butt if I try to do one in this location, just because of how far my base is away from logs. I guess it's not too bad. Could be worse, right? It's a nice spot, but when you're when you're on your own, you got to definitely. All right, so we're just going to be chilling today. Um, I'm going to wait until sundown. We're going to go to sleep, and then we'll uh, we'll start our big day in the morning. I am going to cook this meat up, though. I've been losing a lot of meat when we're out and about. It obviously goes bad really quick. Grow some more. Grow some more yarrow. I gotta get a couple of those planters going. Look at all our provisions set. Oh, it's so good. Nice. So we're finally filled up. Might go down the, on the beach here and do a little hunt. See if we can maybe get some birds, some feathers. Because we got... It's about 3.30 in the afternoon. I think it might be actually on the... So I dug up that one. I dug up that one. It's another green dot that way. Uh, I think that purple mark that's like this way, right in front of us. Um, I think that was one I had to dig up. It's all good. We'll check that shit tomorrow. Undead Comrade with the Super Chat. Thank you so much, man. Uh, I'm in a stream. One thing I learned was you could change the color of the LEDs. And you, yeah, yeah, with the little middle buttons. Yeah, it's shit's so cool. Yeah, being able to change the colors. I like it white because it's, it's just the brightest. It's the brightest and easiest to see. But thank you so much, Undead. I appreciate the Super Chat, man. Also got to build another fish trap at some point. Fish trap is kind of pointless though when you got Calvin, Fisherman 9000, until they nerf him. Just looking for some seagulls. And also, I want to go check. I think it's the beach um, up there where the... I don't know if it's the beach up there where the uh, the handgun was. But I know there's a pistol rail on one of these beaches. I, I don't think it's the beach I'm at currently. I think it's a different one. And there is no seagulls out. I 
I built a bird. Yeah, I got a bird nest at my house right now. I get feathers out of there, too, but we're also trying to hunt for some meat. Oh, there, I see some birds over there in the distance. Because I get that pistol rail, I could throw the flashlight on the pistol, and, um... I don't know. Does anybody know if the pistol flashlight uses batteries? Like, if you got to recharge it? Okay, so a lot of the birds are up in, way up in the air right now. They're not coming down. It does use batteries? Okay. Realistically, you know what we should be trying to use, chat? Frickin' slingshot, man. Well, that shoots way high. I gotta practice with this thing. I don't even remotely understand how to aim it. Got it. Slugs. Oh, it's Virginia. She's back, guys. I'm gonna try to give her that GPS tracker so we can know where she is. Thank you, Virginia. Yep. So we can give her this GPS tracker. I don't know if I want to give her the handgun, though, chat. It's my baby. I mean, I could always go get another one, but... Mm-hmm. I, I'm not gonna lie though, I kinda want my camo outfit back though. <laughs> Sorry, Virginia. It's not winter time. I wanted to see the camo outfit's effectiveness. Oh, is the camo outfit only for her? Oh, I actually think it might only be for her. Yeah, it doesn't have any stats. Got it. I lost my handgun. I mean, I'm pretty sure we'll benefit her having it. All right, it's starting to get dark out.
Tomorrow's gonna be a big day, guys. I gotta... Oh, man. The, the reason... I, I'm not... I'm gonna be real with you guys. The reason why I didn't want to give her the handgun... Is because... I didn't want to swim back out and get another one. I already, yeah, I already got the can opener. Epic. It is so dark. I can't even see. There we go. It's like that moment where the sun is setting. It's actually harder to see anything. Like, it, it, it's so dark. Yeah, that, that that that's the thing is I was I, I just was like, man, I don't know if I want to fucking swim out there and get another gun. We've seen how much of a process it was the first time, guys. Why do we got to do it again? Like you you guys know I'm not built I'm not built like that. Oh shit. He's going to have a fucking mountain of fish here. All right, <laughs> stop it. I'm going to build a couple extra racks. Yo, Kelvin doesn't play, chat. You tell him to fish, that man will fish. Throw this on there. Now I gotta build another one. I don't want the base to be too big, so if I do wall this in, I don't want to, like... I don't want it to be too out of control. Hey, bro, you got so much... I'm gonna light a fire out here. Army, get with the Thank you so much for the gifted membership. I really appreciate it. How are you doing tonight? That's so kind of you. Whoever receives that, welcome to the family. We're just in a good spot for freaking. I guess if you built your base somewhere not right next to the water, fish probably wouldn't be this prevalent. But yeah, I feel I feel like we are wicked at an advantage because we built here. Did a lot of you guys build like right next to like a river, or is that is that not like common practice? I'll do another one. You can't get fish from the ocean, only rivers.
My man is the best fisherman ever. Let's get more. Get one of those cooking up. Drop the other two on here. Rickster with the five months. Thank you so much. And unique with the super chat. I would never play this game myself, uh, but I do like watching. So thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Unique. Thank you. Thank you for the love. Uh, let's get in here. Get some sleep. I would never play this game myself, but I do like watching, so thank you. Guess we're, we're fucking sleeping outside. <laughs> oh, my fish! I burned it! Damn it! Hey, happy birthday, Caspi, too, by the way, man. Uh, Caspi said... <laughs> nah, I seen it. I didn't even see you say it. Caspi turned to big 2-0 today, chat. Nah, I'm just kidding. He turned a big 2-1. He turned a big 2-1. Now, you guys see that standing out in the field right there? I believe that that's a, that's a fucking mutant. So, uh, let's eat. Let's, let's get that happy birthday in the chat for Caspi. Yeah, he, he turned a big 2-1. They grow up quick, don't they? All right, so we're gonna. Oh shit! Damn it! Okay, so this is already starting to get a little dust. We got mutants near our base. As if the cannibals weren't bad enough. And I tried that backpack cycling thing that you guys were talking about. Um, that shit doesn't work. Like, I hit Q and it doesn't work. I'm gonna try to see if I can get up close to this dude. Pop him in the face with an arrow. Yeah, I could build walls and, and, and stuff like that, but... Casper, I was trying to promote you to 21, bro. 21. Would you do something for me? <laughs> I, I, I think I need to, we gotta take care of this dude wonder if I can get her to come out and fight come on come on Oh, 
It's just gonna keep my gun, chat. There it is. All right, let's let's deal with this. We got it. These arrows fly so much different than the, uh, stone. Hit. What am I- Oh, those were my carbon arrows! Lobbed a bunch of these shits out into the abyss. I'm not gonna waste too much time trying to find them though. Yo, she got a whole fucking rabbit, dude. Thank you. I've actually, I actually have not had a rabbit yet. Alright, let's head out, guys. We got we got business to take care of today. We're gonna go see if the key card we got opens up that one underground tunnel. Uh, we're gonna go dig up that grave. I don't know. If she, I don't think she's gonna follow us, though. Can you bird the dead dudes? I'm pretty sure you... I don't know. I don't... Actually, I don't know. Maybe you'd have to build a fire on them, but yeah, you can, I don't think you could pick their bodies up like you can the cannibals. The reason why I don't have uh, Kelvin get logs while I'm out and about, because what ends up happening... What ends up happening is once he's like, oh, I, I can't do it anymore. I don't want to do it anymore. Then he comes off and tries to follow me. Holy shit. There's a whole group of them out there. So we're going to try to bypass these dudes. Will I play the Suicide Squad game? Yeah, I, I might check it out. Like I said, I haven't even played. I, I still been thinking about trying the Arkham uh, games on the channel. I just don't know how well they'll do. Because um, I've never, you know, I've never played the Arkham games. And uh, that's that's actually a series I'm super excited to try. I think we're good. Might have a couple of them following me, so let's keep it moving.
Cannibals. Lots of cannibals. Ooh. Must be a big camp over here or something, because there's like on of these dudes. Carry with the one month. Thank you so much. Um, be careful, Calvin, because you can lose him if you die. Yeah. I mean, if he dies, he dies. I think my next playthrough, I'm actually going to try to play without Kelvin. Oh, yeah, it was this one, I believe, right? Yep. So much... We got cannibals around here. One of them spotted me. Oh, man, look at this shit. They're freaking... They are legion. High cannibal activity in this part of the map. Squirrel scared me. <laughs> Oh, look at that big-ass cannibal base there. Yo, they're all wearing so much armor now. I think that's what... that That's, that's the hard part, is the enemy... They, like, change over time. Like, it's not... Like, like now they're all wearing, like, mutant armor. And, uh, that shit's thick. They can survive a headshot easily from the bow and arrow when they got that armor on their face. Where was the... I believe it's right over here. Yep. So I don't know if the natives attack each other. I know they fight the mutants, though. They, like, they, they, there are warring factions in the game. Uh, and, and thank you, all the new subscribers to the channel. I really appreciate it. Guys, already almost 350 likes on the stream. I do have a flashlight. I just don't have a lot of batteries, so that's why you guys see me prioritizing a lighter. So many crossbow bolts, and I've never even, haven't even found a crossbow yet. I guess I could say the same about the shotgun, though. I got a ton of shotgun shells and... So this is a good, like, underground food storage area. Lots of food down here. Let's see if the key card works on this door. Probably not. Maybe? Yes, it does. What?
Kari again with another super chat. Sakuna with flashlight attachment is meta in caves and pops enemies' heads like oh there it is. That see that that's beautiful right there. Thank you so much, by the way, man. I really appreciate the love. And then we got C with the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations on 80k. Uh, thank you. I really appreciate that. I still can't believe it, guys. 80,000 subscribers. It's so hard to... So much. And, uh, you know, I appreciate you guys getting me to the... Oh, there it is. Talking all that shit about not having a crossbow. We just got one. Uh, but seriously, I, I really appreciate it. Chris with the Super Chat. Uh, digging all the games you're streaming lately. I appreciate you. I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. Uh, you know, it is always tough to... Uh, Find, you know, a whole lot of games that everybody enjoys, you know, but the fact that, you know, you're enjoying most of the stuff I'm playing, I really, that makes me happy, man. We just got ourselves a crossbow chat. There it is. I'm pretty sure there's probably some attachments for this bad boy, too. Uh, how many bolts do I have? Can I combine that with digging all the games you're streaming lately? I appreciate you. Oh, you can put the laser on the crossbow. Props for longer format. Okay, Many the... try to maximize adverts and number of bids, and I've never seen adverts for scam games, peen pills, or groin grooming. <laughs> Uh, yeah, ain't, uh, so angry. When it comes to ads, man, um, because I do live streams, I don't place my own ads. Um, that's why if you guys watch live, you'll never see an ad. Uh, now, when my stream goes live as a video, though, after the fact, um, YouTube places ads, and they place a lot of them on my, my after videos, which is quite annoying. Um, the only thing I can do at that point is remove them. Uh, or delete them, but yeah, it's 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 actually quite quite frustrating. But angry, thank you so much for the super chat, but I appreciate you. Inferno, thank you for the super chat. Yeah, we found the the shovel and the key card, and I got myself this crossbow, and I'm actually full on bolts. So if we ever need to get our hands on crossbow bolts, we know that we can come in here. There's quite a few of them. Fingers. Want to test out the crossbow on them? I didn't. I didn't expect this area to be this big. Oh, we got extra bolts, so what I'm going to do is we're going to throw the flashlight attachment on on the crossbow. works. Doesn't work extremely well on a crossbow, though. Uh, just because of where it is, it's blocked. It's right on that top rail. What if there's a scope you could put on this... Uh, stuff can go under barrel, just not on this, because this doesn't have a rail.
A lot easier to aim than the, uh, the bow and arrow. Especially if you can get a scope for it. Yeah, there's, uh, there's a bow and arrow. Yep. Crossbow is clutch, though. So yeah, we need crossbow bolts. We come into this, uh... This location here, we can get tons of them. Oh, uh, definitely, uh, and it hits harder than the bow. Let me see here. Um, let's see how many bolts we can hold in total. 15. So I got 15 crossbow bolts. That's max stack. I don't know if you can make a quiver to hold more. Place keeps going. No loot in here. That's for oh, we got another key card. Virginia's key card. Those are normal people, and they turned into mutants. One more artifact.
Yeah. Got mutants sitting around in here. Got a dress we could probably give to Virginia. Did you, did you see those people? Looks like they jumped. I don't know if these things are actually... What the fuck is that? Looks like somebody staged all these bodies. How do you get back out? <laughs> oh, my tanks are empty. There we go. Dude, I need to I can't even swim down there if I wanted to. I'll take it these guys are dead. Bacon butt. Okay, we got food on the tables. Let's grab as much as we can. Okay, I think they're all dead. Yo, who staged their bodies like this? We're gonna go check that water. Hopefully my, uh... My tank's refilled. I, I thought I refilled them, but it's... it didn't, like... See when you, like, click a new tank? See if that works. I think that's everything. Let's go down here and check in the water. There we go. Oh, so does it automatically do it? Okay. <laughs> 
Put my swimsuit on. <laughs> Uh, Dana with the two months. Thank you so much. How you doing today? I'm so dark. I can't see Here we go I appreciate the support Dana. How you doing today? So much damage right there. I would I, I can't equip my weapons uh, while you're swimming Come back up here. I need to heal. I don't want to take a single hit from these dudes because they'll they'll wreck me. Um, and my gun isn't reloaded, and I can't even get a chance to do it. So. I'm going to heal up, put the armor on. That way I don't have to worry about taking a hit and dying. got out before. We know it's possible. <laughs> Might have just got lucky, chat. Get rid of the lighter. Thing is, it doesn't even let you put the lighter away while you're in the water. Never mind. Okay, so I can stand up right here. This is all I need. We'll pop meds. Heal up with that. Go ahead and throw this armor on. Perfect. 
and then pop this. Yo, is that flask not? Our flask is freaking empty, man. All right, it's all good. Um, uh, I don't think I want to use the taser. Um, think we'll switch to. Time for war. Attack you while you're in your backpack? I felt like I got attacked when I was in my backpack before. So now we'll get our new pieces of armor on. Army Cat with another gifted membership. Thank you so much. Knight Rider, how you enjoying it? Yeah, I didn't. When we came into this uh, area, you know, and I opened it up with that key card, I, I got to be honest, I did not expect this. Um, I didn't think it was going to go this deep. I thought we were just going to open up, maybe have a room. 
that we checked, you know, and then and then left. A little a little bit more than what I bargained for initially. Well, Army again, thank you so much out here showing so much love every day. See, the laser mounted on the crossbow sits on the top, so when it beams out, the crossbow blocks the laser. You can't even see where it's aiming. Um, I'll show you what I'm talking about. So say you put the laser attachment on the crossbow. It mounts on this top rail. Right? So then, when you have it out, You could, you could see where it's aiming when you're aiming like this. But if you try to actually bring it up to shoot, it blocks it. So what, are you supposed to just shoot it from the hip like this? I guess if you can. Let me see if you could. You might be able to just shoot it from the hip like that. Maybe that's the whole point of the laser is not having to... Uh, Ah, uh, yeah, so you have to aim to shoot this one. And as you guys can see, it blocks it. You can't even see. So I'm wondering if there's like a scope. Put a crossbow. I left the tarp there because it's a safe spot and I have a billion of them. Um, I got a lot of tarps. They're quite easy to find. Probably gonna be nighttime. Maybe. Yep. That's what I thought. Okay, we're gonna set up another tarp out here. Is this game good? I I, I absolutely love this game. I think it's phenomenal.
You know, and the fact that it's still being worked on, you know, they, they got six months, they want to add more stuff. <laughs> Eat some breakfast really quick. I think we should be okay. I don't know if they're coming at us. Want to cook up some of this raw meat, but I don't know if they're going to let me. So we're back down near our base, actually. We'll hit down on the beach. I'm going to cook up breakfast, and then we'll head to that uh, that grave, and we'll dig that up. I also got to fill my water. I do have the shovel. Yep, we got the shovel last episode. Elvin over there loving life chat. Fill our canteen. Cook up this meat, and then, like I said, we'll head back out. Yeah, the, the cave for the shovel was pretty intense. It, it really was. to eat that I'm gonna cook up the other two pieces and then we'll just keep them in our inventory that is one of the big improvements they made in this one um, being able to cook the, the meat on the fire and put it in your inventory uh, generally when you cook meat on the fire you would have to eat it immediately there was no way to like pick it up Would I ever try playing co-op or multiplayer? I would, but um, I feel like early game, you know what I mean? Especially when it's a brand new game like this, um, playing multiplayer kind of dilutes the immersion in the game, you know what I mean? Uh, especially for viewers, because you guys, at that point, you're no longer watching me play the game. You're kind of just watching me interact with other people. And games like this can get boring really, really quick or just become hectic. And uh, I don't know. I like the immersion. I like really, you know, falling into a world, but when other players are in there and they're talking, they're joking, they're doing this, they're doing that, um, I feel like it kind of breaks it, breaks it up a little bit for me. Uh, not saying it's not fun, I'm just saying, I, I, I don't know, it's personally not my, uh, my go-to style.
Um, and then you're you're not playing at your own pace at that point. Now you got to worry about everybody else and what they're doing, and then you know people doing too much stuff, and then you not being able to do it yourself. It's it's just weird. So that's why I enjoy playing solo. Okay, so we're going to head up to that. What the hell was it? I believe it's this one up here. So we just got to keep going this way. So this area is absolutely swarming with these little dudes and cannibals. Being followed. But yeah, after my first playthrough, you know what I mean? That Then I would be okay playing with other people, but for my first playthrough ever in a game, I would never play a game like this uh, multiplayer. It would just take so much away. I honestly didn't even want to use Kelvin because I feel like Kelvin kind of takes away a lot, but he's still cool. Kelvin's cool. Um, but it definitely takes, like... I don't have to really struggle for food because I can just tell Calvin go get me some fish. Calvin, go get me some fish, and then boom, I don't. Even, and it's just automated, like. Okay, so I've actually not been over here before. I don't I might have been here before actually. No, definitely not. I've not seen this. Let's get our spear out. Are these coffins? Yeah, I think these are A lot of bone over here. I'm actually going to craft up some bone armor. We got extra rope and extra bone, so we might as well. Holy crap. sets. Reminds you of the TV series Lost. It, yo, Tojo, it actually has that kind of vibe to it, man. Um, you know, because Lost has a lot of that, like, mystery. You know what I mean? Um, and in this game, it's, it's the same way. You know what I mean? It's like, yeah, you're on an island. It's a survival game. But, yeah, there is a lot of mystery to it that you're trying to figure out at the same time.
Definitely wanted to hit that up. How far are we from the POI? It's not far. But we got a lot of cloth out of that. Decent bit of bone armor and rope. I don't think I want to check. Oh yeah, I don't have it. Aloe vera actually is quite hard to spot, at least. We need to try to start getting some aloe so we can make our own health potions. Or a health mix. I, 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 have, I have my creepy armor on right now. I guess I could throw some of this. Not fully armored out. Cruising right now. A good area to hunt, and I want. I actually want to try out the crossbow on maybe some of these rabbits. Yeah, I haven't been collecting very many pelts because I haven't been doing any hunting. Uh, mainly, all our meat keeps coming from Kelvin. Uh, where are the pelts at? I know I have at least one rabbit pelt. Oysters. Eat these before they spoil. Okay. Here we go. Animal hide. So you can make hide armor. I see the graves right here. It's the POI. Or is that not the POI? Crossbow hits different chat. It is far superior to the bow and arrow. 
And it's so much easier to aim. I hit that guy's mask over here with the the other arrow. I don't think we're getting that one back though. Murder chat. I was just doing what needed to be done. She did this to me, chat. She did that. We just had to do what we had to do. She's coming back. She went and got the... She went and got that. <laughs> she went and got the heat, chat. See him up in the tree over there. Well, she ain't got the <laughs> homies yet. <laughs> Rest in peace, brother. He was he was dying painfully right there, chat. I think we're clear. Get the shovel out. Get the digging. Yeah, there's one coffin. Yeah, I told you, I, I, I burned a lot of the bodies uh, before. Uh, that's why I have so much bone at home. Uh, and my inventory is full of bones right now. That's the only reason why I'm not going out of my way to burn these bodies. I have, literally probably have two full bone holders back home full of bone. So these graves, I don't think were the POI then. No, POI is actually up here. Oh, shit.
Yeah. He, he don't care about the mask. Yeah. Drop. Drop, bro. Drop. I don't think he's getting back up from that one. Nope. So when you shoot those guys with the bow... She went and definitely called the crew. We got a whole freaking tribe here trying to fight us right now. Yep, so this is our POI here. This chat, we just got the shotgun. It's a Ramington. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Fuck, I didn't even... It was just a reaction, guys. I actually got a lot of slugs. I also have a rail for this, so let me see. Shotgun rail combined. Camrocks, holy shit, thank you so much with the super chat, brother. Never thought I would see this level of uh, savagery from Brian killing Fam's Grave Robin. I dubbed the King Savage of the Frick. <laughs> no, I, I didn't mean it, man. Um, Mr. Part, where you obtained the cross? I just got the crossbow this episode. We got the crossbow at the end of last episode, Leonardo. 
Should we go uh, raid their camp? Looks like it's all the women back at the camp. Feel wrong, chat. Oh, savage, guys. It just, it feels wrong, man. <laughs> it's weird. You might as well go full savage god tier, bro. Was that the one I shot earlier? What? Yo, he didn't... He didn't have his mask on. Nice, got a skin pouch. Yeah, the mattresses are nice. Still wrapped in the plastic. What is this? That's a hell of a chair, chat. I'm si I was sitting on the ash cheeks. Like, they got this figured out. The ultimate comfort for ash cheeks is sitting on more ash cheeks. We never... <laughs> It's science, guys. It's it's easy science. Camrox with another set. You might as well go full savage god tier mode. No, dude. Like, come on, I mean, how many people in chat have... Uh, we can't say it doesn't work unless we've tried it. How many of you guys have tried to sit on ass cheeks? And if you have, was it... Was it comfortable?
Okay, actually, I do got to head down to that other beach where the pistol was. Get ourselves our handgun. The haunting. <laughs> it's the ghost chat. Right, this way. Yeah, I, I gotta swim out, get up. I heard there's a pistol suppressor, guys, in uh, one of the bunkers. And I'm like, yo, you know I need that. Then we're going to start splinter selling these damn camps. Like, you don't understand how clutch a suppressor would be in this game. Especially in the mutant caves, they all react off sound. Uh, I appreciate that, Diane. I do. Yeah, a lot of you guys, you know, follow my channel with episode one, and so many of you guys subscribed, and I really appreciate the support. It really means a lot. Army Gale with another gifted membership. Thank you. Army Gale has single-handedly... Shown so much love to so many members of the community. It's absolutely mind boggling. Uh, Jackson, uh, thank you so much for the super chat. I'm looking at PJs or Navy SEAL, like Special Warfare. I really don't want to go in uh, the Army, but I don't know how to choose if you want to do both. Um, I mean, it all just kind of depends on what you want to do. PJs are not really combat oriented, um, they're more or less like. They're pararescue. Like, your job is to rescue, um, like, say a Navy SEAL's on a, a mission in South America, and, you know, what, they're, like, embedded deep behind enemy lines or something like that. When those guys get shot or something happens to them, it's not like they can call on a normal army medevac because they're in a country where America doesn't have that type of stuff set up. Uh, we don't have medevacs set up, so um, PJs are the guys who go in and get those guys out. Uh, yeah, the, they're, they're, they're really, really, really high speed, like, pararescue. Um, Navy SEAL, you'll be more combat-oriented. So it kind of all just depends on what you want to do. Nice, some more slugs. I actually got my hands on quite a bit of shotgun ammo. Oh, Doug, no way, brother, with a huge super chat, man. Thank you so much. Uh, first off, God's Demon with the membership. Welcome to the family. I really appreciate that. Uh, seriously, welcome, welcome. And, uh, Doug, man, I, I appreciate you so much, brother. How are you doing today, man? That's so kind. For 80K, congrats, man. Okay, we're getting close to the beach right down here. Um, we got to swim out, get our handgun.
Yeah, when I was in the Corps, um, Marine Raiders, because uh, I was with 3rd Recon Battalion, um, the Marine Raiders, we actually had a recruiter right out in Camp Schwab, Okinawa, um, because so many guys would go from my unit to into the Raiders. And... Um, I actually went and filled out my... Well, back when back then it was called MARSOC. Um, I actually went and filled out my MARSOC package when I was uh, super high speed. I never ended up going through with it because I didn't end up re-enlisting. Um, but yeah, it was, it was on my agenda and I was just like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm getting out. <laughs> All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to come over here. We're going to set up camp. And then in the morning we'll swim out there. It used to be Force Recon, uh, like way back in the day they called it Force Recon, then they switched to MARSOC, and then they switched to, I believe, the Marine Raiders is what they're, they're called, Raiders now. Super, super dark. That's all good. We're going to set up a fire over here. See, it's like, it's so dark, you know, at night. And it's like, you're, you're, you're cozy around your fire, but you know damn well that there could be a mutant, there could be a freaking group of cannibals standing right over... It's, it's no sketch, man. Oh, it's your lady's birthday? There it is. Hey, well, tell her I said happy birthday, Doug. Doing well. Day off. Won't be on long. It's my lady's birthday. Yeah, I'll be getting the rail. I'll be getting the rail for sure so we can put the flashlight on that bad boy. Dave, I'm also going to save in the morning, get some sleep. We're going to head out, get the handgun again. This damn shark. Oh, we need water. If we get eight, we could just reload, right? And get eight again. The armor looks slimy. No, no, no. It's not, it's not slimy. It's a little damp, you know? Just a little damp. See? But it's, a, it's a nice finish. Yeah, I put the GPS on, uh, Virginia. Since I got armor on, though, these sharks sh shouldn't be able to really kill me. I'll be able to do some damage, but, uh, I'm annoyed that I'm going to lose armor. right near me.
Get on the fucking boat, dude. I do have the flippers. I don't. Does that actually make you swim fast? Yo, I think the sharks eat the damn seagulls that sit on the water, chat. There it is. Um, Yo, when you got the fins out, you swim fast as fuck, dude. dude I should have had the fins on the whole time, guys. Look at this. We're like... It's just the overhand. Grease lightning. Go, grease lightning. Go, grease lightning. In them jets on chat. <laughs> uh, but you walk slow as hell on land when you got them on. All right, let's see if we can go find his pistol rail. She'd never search this beach at all. Yeah, I did come over here, but we ended up going up that way. It was winter time when we were here last time. I gotta say, so far, I think my favorite weapon in the game is probably the crossbow. Uh, so, I gave a pistol to one of our, um, to Virginia. So, one of our followers, he has the other handgun, and now I have one. Um, let me see here. Of course, it went bad. See that little radio symbol, though? That's where Virginia is. A little green blip. I put a GPS tracker on her. I covered a whole... Now, I've actually not been on the other side of this. Like, I've been on pretty much this whole area. Uh, but whatever bit of the island's on the other side of the snowy mountain, I've actually not been over there yet. But well, the map is huge, man. It's freaking massive.
It's actually quite a nice beach, man, to build on. A river here. Some fish out of there. Got trees close by. Missed a super chat. Higher Stone, thank you for the super chat. Search all the rocks around the beach and not far um, from the lip. The, for the pistol right yeah that's what we're looking for right now but thank you so much for the super chat I really appreciate it Is that the radio This might be it. Yep, there it is. Uh, we got some more handgun ammo also. I had a pretty decent campsite here. So now we got the pistol rail. Let's go ahead and get the pistol equipped on the backpack. Throw the rail on there. Get that bad boy. Throw the flashlight on there. Can you put the laser on there too? Now I gotta see how the aiming with the laser works, though, because you you don't have to... The pistol you can shoot without um, ADSing. But I actually don't mind ADSing. What? Oh, I didn't... I didn't confirm it. Wait. What? My attachments go. <laughs> it just bug my attachments. Uh, save and reload, and they'll be back. Okay, okay, cool. So, do I reload, or do I have to reload my old save? Okay, so it's just a visual bug. Like, like they, they, I still have them. They're just, they're just gone. Got it. Yeah, I mean, I could create a new, sp a new spot. It's, it's all good. I can just build a freaking, or create a new save, and not save over my other one, just in case. I mean, it's not a huge deal, but you know, I'd rather not have to swim back out. Damn it. Okay, so it created a new save. Let's go.
Uh, we'll be playing Ark uh, later on tonight, yes, and that'll be the second stream for the day. Can't carry any more pistols. What? Oh, is it saying I have more than one pistol now? Oh, they're still gone, chat. Yeah, I'm gonna have to reload my old save and swim my ass back out there. The pistol, I don't care about. The pistol, um, the pistol rail, I don't care about because they're both right there. Um, the the pistol flashlight though, yeah, that that's in like a cave. Like I'm not, definitely not trying to go back and get that right now. It's all good. We'll go up. I'm gonna throw the fin. Now that we know the fins turn us into actual Aquaman, um, we'll throw those bad boys out. I'm not too worried about the shark when we got these fins on. Army Gale again. Oh, you do way too much for me, Army Gale. Seriously. Thank you for the membership. YouTube's gonna give me a hard time today. Let's see where the shark is, and then we'll jump once he goes past and swim out. Try putting the stuff on again before I leave. Well, I don't have the pistol rail yet. There it is. It's like, yo, where the hell is the shark at, man? Yeah, the fins change everything. Oh, man, it makes it so much nicer.
I'm gonna build a little save before I uh, go ahead and do this. Go to base and unload what? You can't. It's not like you can unload stuff in this game. What's in your inventory is kind of just in your inventory. Okay, so we're going to create a save here. Where we can get this figured out. Okay, so we're going to combine the pistol with the rail. Okay. Alright, so now the pistol has the rail. Um, and then we'll go ahead and throw the flashlight on the handgun. Here we go, so we got the flashlight on the handgun. We got the laser on the handgun. There we go. So we got it, chat. We got it. The only problem with the putting a flashlight on the pistol, though, is I don't want the battery to die. How do you change the batteries on the flashlight handgun? Oh, it doesn't need batteries. Yeah, that was what I was hoping. I was hoping that it, it, it didn't need batteries. Awesome. So we're good then. Such a good little setup here. Um, now, the problem is ADSing. You're not going to want... Once you have the laser on there, you're not ADSing. You're kind of just going to be pointless laser and just firing from the hip. Uh, with the handgun. All right, we're looking good, chat. Now we just got to get a suppressor, right? But I believe that's like on the other side of the island in another underground cave that... Okay, so I've went in that one, I've went in that one, I've went in that one. I don't know if I've been in that other one up here. Um, I, I, yeah, I'm full on electronic parts. Why well, didn't break the radio? Guess we could try that other underground cave area. We got food, we got water on us. I got means to collect more if we need. Time is it? Ten in the morning. We're good. That's right. I don't have that much nine millimeter. I got so much freaking shoddy though. I think I actually might might run the shoddy for a little bit. Hmm. 
Ding. I think they know better, chat. Right? Yo, we shot body parts off. Well, now he knows better. Interesting. Now, I don't know if I've already been in this area or not. I don't, I don't quite recall. What the hell? The shotgun is a monster. Probably the strongest gun in the game, right? I was these little dudes, man. I'd give it up. This is actually gonna be quite a walk. Yeah, you could change uh from slugs to um to the buckshot. I don't have buckshot that I only have uh slugs right now. Bird shot. I don't know. Is it is it buckshot or bird shot? What's the other type of ammo you can get? Guys, you know those cannibals are. Oh. With an arm and a leg to screw with you. Plug and buck. Also keep our eyes open for any wildlife. They really did a good job of like making this forest feel like a damn forest. You know what I mean? Even in the first game, it, the forest was nice, but it wasn't dense. Like this, this has a, like a density. 
Oh, it just feels so alive. Even though it's just trees and grass. So weird. Oh, Francis, thank you so much for the super chat. Love your gameplay. Greetings from Rochester, New York. Hey, you're not too far from where I am. A fellow upstate New Yorker to a, another fellow upstate New Yorker. Francis, I appreciate it. Cannibal up here. them both. Probably try to get some of that stealth armor made at some point. Get some stealth armor, get a suppressor chat. We're hunting these guys. The hunters are going to eventually become the hunted. Trying to keep the river to my left, that way I can navigate. I'm excited to see uh, what I'm holding a crossbow right now. I'm excited to see what they're going to be adding to the game also uh, going forward. Because I know they said the next six to eight months, they want to add a whole bunch of more stuff. Like there's so they, they, that's how they explain it. Oh, there's so much stuff that we still want to add to the game and so many bugs and things that they want to clean up and polish. And I'm like, yo, I'd love for them to add a fucking log sled. Add a log sled. <laughs> More wildlife? They got deer, moose, rabbits, squirrels. Um, I haven't seen any, like, alligators or anything like that. Turtles. Another cannibal. We're completely invisible right now. One, one thing I would like them to change or tone down 
is this. Let me see if I can get to... Listen, listen to the noise this makes. Now, I know they're trying to go, like, for the sound for when you, like, snap something off a branch. But for me, it's so, like, a tingy. It actually, like, bugs my ears. Like, I don't know if you guys hear that snap. It's like a little, like, I don't know. I, I can't even explain it. That, like, snap sound right there. It's so loud. <laughs> Courtney with the 13 months hardened survivor. Oh my god, thank you so much. I keep up the amazing content. You never failed to entertain. Thank you for all the videos and time and effort you put in. Best YouTube streamer I've watched. I really appreciate that, Courtney. Seriously. Yeah, like a, yeah, that super like whippy sound. Yeah. Might just be my little delicate baby ears, though. All right, we're almost there, guys. Took freaking most of the morning and afternoon to travel up here, but we're almost there. Heard an animal. What is that? What the fuck is that, dude? They heard we got the shotgun chat. I think those were the little chip dudes wrapped in fucking mutant armor. What was that noise I made? What noise, man? I didn't make no noise. Casper, you know me, man. I'm cool as a cucumber, bro. Got another uh, cannibal camp over there. I've raided. Yeah, we hit a cannibal camp earlier. Yeah, they're they're still freaking following me, man. We hit a cannibal camp earlier. Um, it was filled with women, cannibals, and I. You know me. I'm not a savage, so we left them alone. For anybody who is just now coming in, don't listen to anything in chat. Says I left. I spared them. The women and children, and we just we just kept it moving. Chat's gonna, you know how chat is. They're gonna sit here and they're gonna lie. They're gonna say that I freaking did all this stuff. Don't listen to them. Chat lies. We turn this shit, this, we turn this shit into the Titanic. All right. That's how, that's how awesome I was. I really don't think I've been to this one yet.
don't recall this area. Maybe? Well, maybe I did come to this one. Oh, no. Nope. Definitely didn't. Okay. Dig it up! Oh! My bad, guys. I, I didn't... I, I, hey, relax, relax, buddy, relax. I don't want... No! No! <laughs> Now, Brian, you don't need to be telling us that we lie. Especially when you just did lol. See, she's crying, chat. I said... Ah, <laughs> uh, go! Super Tim, thank you for the super chat, brother. I appreciate you, man. Nah, I did come on. Well, uh, <laughs> it wasn't supposed to be like this, guys. I think she ran off to go get her homies. Uh, natural causes. Thank you for the super chat. I say clear the village. Sorry, it's no orphans. <laughs> See, I spared her. I, I spared her. You've seen it here firsthand, chat. I only killed the people who tried to attack me. A uh, king of the New England Patriots. Thank you so much for the membership. Hardened survivor at that, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I really appreciate the support, man. And Sherry with the super chat. I'm with Casper. Every time you make the noise, you make me wonder if you... <laughs> Hey man, listen. When you when you serve with some Marines, you'll realize we make all types of noises. I am with Casper. Every time you make the noise, it makes me wonder if you are in the Marines, Army, or the Girl Scouts. It's a war cry. It's a war cry, you know? If there is a noise coming out of me, that's just, that's all it is. It's just a war cry. This one was buried hella deep, chat. Trying to find the hatch here. Have us out here digging for days, man. After I slaughtered her people, she's just kind of standing there watching me dig this hole. I mean, after I defended my- not slaughtered her people. Defending myself in self-defense. Oh, but again, Jerry, thank you for the love, bro. I appreciate your man.
We're out here digging, chat. Gonna be a multi-day dig at, at this rate. Casper says I would have cooked them, so you aren't that bad. <laughs> there it is. See? I, I even, I'm pretty sure chat, so, like most of you guys would have probably chased her down, chopped her legs up, built effigies. Stop that. That noise you made wasn't learned in the marine flaw. <laughs> <laughs> no, see, Doug, everybody develops their... Uh, what noise did I make? I don't even think I made a noise, chat. There we go. Maintenance B. And I scared her off because I didn't want her to creep up on me when I was trying to freaking, um, when I was trying to dig the rest of that hole. I think I have been in this one. Did I lose my attachments again, chat? Lost my attachments again. Shotgun with the light. I don't think I've been in this one. No, yeah, I've definitely not been in this one. And there it is. We got a freaking suppressor right now. Uh, Barry, I really appreciate that. Seriously, man. All right, we're full up on arrows. I'm um, Pat with the super chat, brother. Thank you, thank you. Um, was that the noise from Gremlins heard? Double dog. There, there was no noise. I'm being set up. Well, you, you guys know what it's time for now. We got a suppressor chat. It's time to hunt. Oh! We just got a compound bow. 
This place is full of all types of goodies. We just got a compound bow and a suppressor for our handgun. Good God. Time is it? Six at night. We'll sleep. We'll see what time he wakes up in the morning. Seven in the morning. Awesome. Uh, so we're going to eat, drink. cook up that meat when we get to the surface. I want to test out that bow, man. D majors, brother, with the five gifted members, man. Holy crap, dude. Seriously, thank you. That's five more people. Welcome to the fam. Get it to yourself, brother. It's not how it was supposed to go. I guess we could test out that bow too. See, see if it's any good. The compound. Feels nice. The only thing is uh, figuring out how to aim with it proper. I have heard that noise only twice in my life. On your stream and once when I started my truck and the cat that was sleeping on my engine made THST noise. <laughs> Damn, Jerry is like that. <laughs> A little stink skip. Thank you so much, brother, for the super chat, man. Lies, Jerry! I don't even... I still don't know what noise you guys are talking about. When did I when did I make a noise?
Really, Calvin? Got some extra um, rope around here, so we're going to make some uh, bone armor. Uh, Mr. Taz, thank you so much for the membership, brother. Welcome to the family. Yeah, there's a lot of rope around here, so we might better actually get a couple pieces of bone armor. A uh, lot of rope up here. Holy crap, there's some over there. There's some over here. All throughout the village. More here. Couple more pieces. Uh, but again, Mr. Test, thank you so much. I really appreciate the love. Bad Wolf there says, I'm being sent clips of you murdered. But no lies! Bad Wolf is not true. You know me. What have you ever known me to murder? Ooh. Go. I'm giving you a chance to go. Just, yeah, exactly. Just preventing revenge. That, that's the best way to put that. You know what I mean? Like, I know they're not going to let it go. You know, you can see the body, like, break. Like, that's so crazy. Caspi's the true cannibal in, in, in chat. <laughs> Caspi's all about eating these people. Okay, so we got that on. Caspi's like, we're not we're not wasting any good meat. So I wonder what you could use these mushrooms for, guys. I don't know if maybe you can craft, like, poison with them or something. All 
right, so we gotta hit the river. We're gonna have to fill up our, um... Let's see, over there, you little shit. Kelvin, again, scared the crap out of me. All right, let's bring Kelvin home. Mission accomplished. If you can't beat him, eat him. Destroy tent? What do you mean destroy? Can you destroy their camp? I, I don't believe so. You can. When you break their tents and shit, do they not respawn here anymore? And I want to take another moment to tell you guys thank you so much for all the new subscribers. I really appreciate this, uh, all the support, guys. All right, we're good. All right, Kelvin, let's go. We're headed home. Man, we're actually quite far away from base. I didn't realize how far up we came. A oh, flag. Thank you for the super, brother. I saved Kelvin. Yeah, I know. I, I cleaned that dude up quick with the shoddy. Kelvin didn't even say thank you. I mean, I guess he thanked me with all that fish that he's... That's my way of returning the, the favor. Kelvin's been the fisherman for us. Is that? I think I've seen antlers for a moose, maybe?
I was also thinking about potentially ma moving our base. Yeah, there's a moose down there. Yeah, they're all over the place. I don't know. I yes! At least where we are, we don't have to worry about these little dudes being all over the place. If you build a base in the woods, I feel like you're going to have to worry about these little dudes all the time. Uh, Paul, thank you so much for the gifted, brother. Can you craft crossbow bolts? I don't think so. Day am I on? Day 22. I've survived on the island so far for 22 days. Do trees grow back? I don't, I think, I don't know. If they do, probably very slowly. Might start a little bit of construction when we get back. Try to get some defenses. We did have some mutants near our base um, in the beginning of the episode. Oh, my water. Yeah, I got, Virginia has a gun. Yeah, yeah, we gave her a gun. A sight here. What is that? Is that a kid? It's a...
This is a nice lake here. I wonder how many people build bases over here. This is a dope spot. Huge lake. Animals all over the place. During the winter time, though, this area would probably suck a little bit. Some fish over here. Is there anything at the bottom of the lake? You can take a look. It's fairly shallow for the most part. It does get a little deeper over here. Oh, there's a boat. Some tarps, money, rope. Duck. Gotta get some ducks here. Some money, skeletons. Yeah, this must be cannibals tying people up down here. Just keep hitting straight this way. We'll definitely we should be able to get back to base before night. Get a deer. As long as this little thing can leave me alone. Calvin. We're in the Redwoods, chat. I think that's a deer right there.
Did I hit or did I miss? Oh, I missed. We gotta actually keep moving. We're gonna run out of sun daylight here soon. Yeah, there's a cannibal camp right here to my left. Three o'clock, yeah. We got. We should be able to make it back before night. As long as we don't get sidetracked too much. Does anybody know if there's a scope for the crossbow in this game? Alright, what was the other one we did? Something down here. Nice, we got some ammo for the nine mil. It's empty. What the fuck? Yo, I fucking no, Kelvin needs to go, chat. His dumbass smile. He does that shit on purpose. I'm telling you. See, so th this is the thing, Chat. So when Kelvin's ass gets shot, all right. That's on Kelvin.
Fucker might be aiming too low. Yeah, for sure. You want to aim, I was aiming a little bit low. I gotta practice with the bow before I really use it. I don't want to be whipping arrows out, just... What, what? Where did that bolt even go? the thunder chat. I feel like they're going to hit my base hard. Crazy. I was actually uh, looking at a crossbow today at the store. Never shot one, but Juan, he sent me a compound bow last year, and I was like, oh, I have a compound bow and a crossbow. I do want to thank you guys for almost a thousand likes on the stream. That is that is huge. And um, I really, really appreciate the support. Look at that. That's crazy looking. Like, you know, who would have thought back in the 90s, you know, sitting there playing those Super Mario and shit. One day video games would look like this. <laughs> you know what I mean?
Okay, so we got, uh... We've got some meat that we can cook up here. We got off that deer. So I can do leaf armor, and I can do hide armor in the energy mix. some wall uh, torches done up for in here. Light this damn place up. So all those shelves are full. We're going to have to get some more shelves done up. Let's get some sleep. We'll wake up in the morning, and then uh, we're going to do some, some base building. Some crafting. Get some food in us. Let's get some, uh, some water. Kelvin just lounging, man. Where's Virginia? Oh, she's not far from base. She's up that way. She's just a... She just travels around. All right, so we'll do... uh. We'll start off by doing another shelf here. I can't believe how much uh, food we've been able to amass. It's freaking awesome. So I'm going to need... Cut this log up nice. Whoop. Ah, Sakari with the super chat. Thank you so much, brother. Uh, bunker maintenance C has Sextana. Yeah, actually, I'm going to start looking into crafting that um, Ek armor or whatever it's called. I believe we needed two half or a half of it. Yeah, there we go. Should be enough for the shelf, right? Perfect. Those are full, full. 
Go ahead, do another stack of ramen. It's looking good, guys. Looking good. I was like, yo, that dried meat was looking a little sus. You know what I, <laughs> you know what I mean? So let's see what else we're gonna get going on inside here. We got that. Um, we need to get some aloe vera seeds. So we got a chair done there. Um, trying to make it more homely in this place. We're going to... Homey, not homely. Um, let's look at getting wall torches. Ceiling skull lamp. Actually, I will get one of those. That way I don't got to light this fire. Another one over here, too. Whoop. Now we should have light in here, so I won't have to come inside and freaking light a fire and potentially almost step on it. Yeah, I could do another bed that way. I don't got to worry about Virginia stealing mine every freaking time. He's not here right now, though, so we don't think we got to worry about it. So now we got two beds in here. Bone holders. Swords with a seven months, brother. Have I uh, another 1K like stream? Uh, well deserved, brother. Streams have been popping off lately. Uh, hoping for the scream. I mean, a war cry compilation video. <laughs> Oh, no, dude. The sneezes were bad enough. I could imagine a war cry video. Plus, I don't war cry all that often. I think I sneeze more than I war cry. Thank you so much, brother. I appreciate the seven months, man. And I, I really want to thank you all for over a thousand likes. The 
So that's the one thing I could say they need to add is more stuff to craft. It, does, it seems quite limited um, in comparison to the first game at the moment. But you also have the two different books, though. But you can't really build... The same stuff. Oh. Yeah, see, this is what we need to work on. Defensive walls. Oh, you can make stuff that isn't in the book? So these defensive walls is gonna they're gonna be a pretty big endeavor. We gotta start working on logs again though. Tell him, hey, go get logs, pill holders. So, our little compound I'm going to build here is actually going to have to be quite big. We're going to need, I couldn't even imagine how many logs, a lot. Right. Hundred and twenty or so, maybe more. Yeah, we could probably yeah, George, that's a good idea. Build a couple more holders from I'm about to relocate these holders at some point. Because when I do the wall, I don't want to encase out this far. I'm just going to kind of come a little bit down and go around. Uh, so these holders are probably going to have to go at some point. But we'll do this part of the wall last. That way I, I can just have these holders get filled. One of them did get killed with the trap, uh, or hit by the trap, but at least. I think it killed them and chopped them into pieces. <laughs> Dude, their, their armor is no joke, man. Came pretty hard right there. Let's see how much shoddy ammo do we still have? We still have a decent bit. All 
Army Gal with another gifted member. Thank you so much. Uh, whoever receives that, welcome to the family. Make sure you guys get the heart in the chat. Army Gal here showing love. And Super Tone, um, pushy insurance salesman, just wanted to say, to ask you about your home's warranty. <laughs> That's why they came. Hey, but since when do they travel in packs? Yeah. Huh? Is it? Where? <laughs> looks like a rabbit foot. Mm hmm. That's what it looked like. You can tell by the way the let got like the folded. It's a rabbit. All right, let's get to work now. Sticks or logs? Sticks. So we we're, we were able to defend that pretty nicely. The pushy insurance salesman just wanted to ask you about your home warranty. Yeah. We ain't buying. Should probably build a couple more holders. But the problem is, as soon as the holders are full, Kelvin's gonna freaking derp out and come up to me like, "Oh, what do you want me to do now?" have this whole freaking ridge line cleared. Let's build a couple more holders for him. I'm doing them further out because I'm I don't want them to be within my walls. That's why I'm cuz I'm going to have to move those ones eventually. That's why you guys see me doing them out here for right now. Do yeah, we'll do one more. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to have the log holders inside my base because that's just more 
walls we have to build. They're just logs, you know what I mean? Uh, I don't think you can build bigger holders. Uh, I tried everything. Something better still be working, man. Might just be going to grab a drink. Uh, I don't know if you can make the bigger ones. If anybody could verify that, uh, but I haven't seen. I tried hitting all the buttons. Thank you so much for this, uh, the other six months, man. I'm gonna try absolutely killing it. I appreciate you, brother. I really do, man. Calvin's over here taking a damn union break. Uh, your book, then hold X to switch mode. I, I checked it in, in the book, on, on both parts of the book, there was no... Like, you can rotate it, you can do whatever, and then... In the other side of the book, there's no storage in here, you can just, like... Yeah, that switch mode is just to switch to what style building you want to do. Uh, I was told by uh, someone that there's still, like, they have a bunch of other things that aren't in this build of the game um, that they're still currently working on that we'll eventually see in the future. Uh, Kumalo, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I'm glad, you, I, I'm glad you're enjoying the content, brother. I tried building custom structures with the sticks, but the only thing you can build is a fence. It doesn't allow you to, like, build holders, at least from what I've seen. Good amount of logs here. You can set up a zip line and lip zip the logs down to my base. You could do that in this in this game. I do got the zip line rope.
so can I just do you just build it on your like your own? You know what I mean? Can I just like plop a freaking log in the ground and then attach a zip line to it? Let's see how this works. Oh, you got to make a do you got to make a goal post? Got you, got you. All right. I I, I I'm tracking. It'll be cleaner though if I do a goal post, it'll look cooler. Perfect. I have to go readjust the one on the bottom a little bit, but that should work. Yeah, right here would be much better. It's a little, it's a little crooked. It's a little, it's a little crooked. <laughs> Alright, so how the hell do you do this? 
Do I shoot it down there, or do I... Like, how do you... Because it's not like you can aim this damn thing. There it is. Now I can see it. Got it. I just had to put the white dot on the ground and then walk it up. Perfect. Perfect. Probably could have moved it a little closer to the edge. It would have been a little less funky, but... And Kelvin will just do his thing. Hell yes, Chad. That's what's up. I think it might just be the one. Nope, definitely more than one. So the slingshot doesn't really kill them. I just want to get a little bit more of this freaking. It's a little bit more of this done. Sticks. Oh, Sharky, brother. Holy crap. Thank you for the super chat, man. Just pop it in quickly to say, um, 
Keep up the work, brother. Loving this game and loving this series. I should be watching this episode from the beginning later. I appreciate you, man. Hope you're having a great night, Sharky. And Peter, welcome to the family. Thank you for the membership, man. Grenades of trees. Hey, does that work in this one? Like dynamite in the first one? Only one way to find out, right? Keep up the work, brother, loving this game and loving this series. I shall be watching this episode from the beginning later. Blue Heart. Worked out. Kind of upset. I. Oh, it's getting really dark. Sun's going down. You know, it's crazy because when you stare at the bright light and then you look in the darkness, it actually like takes a second for your eyes to adjust. Yeah, the thing is you can't hold a torch and grab logs at the same time. Darky brother with the 12 months, man. Holy crap. GG on 80k. Uh, Subi joining me in the 100k club. Oh, dude. I don't know, man. It's still crazy to even think about, brother. It's still crazy to even think about. Oh, nice. Yo, where is Calvin at, chat? All these logs building up. What is he doing? Get to work, dude. Hey. Yeah, Calvin, you've been slacking, dude. So you're working over. You're working the night shift, dude. No, no. We'll get logs, fill holders. And I'm going to go to sleep. Z, thank you so much. Uh, cut trees so they fall towards your base, not away. Yeah, I just noticed when we, um, when I did all that grenading there, a lot of those rolled down the hill. Let me see. I think we got some grub we can eat here. It's rotten. Fill up on bacon bites. There we 
we go. All right, Kelvin, let's get to work, man. Yeah, my creek, though, doesn't work very well. The water's not strong enough to actually fully transport it. Why isn't he just grabbing the logs that I've already put over here for him? Oh, you can zip line up? Oh, I forgot. Yeah, with that damn zip line gun, I can. I need to uh, empty my stick inventory too. Forgot in the cave, yeah, we have that mechanism that allows us to ride the lines both ways. Probably build some freaking monster zip lines and start traversing the map super that's why we might have to get our freaking some death stranding going on here chat Yeah, there's no log sled in this one. We got quite the log collection building up down there. But what is he doing, man? He should be filling the holders. This man has no clue, chat. Let's get these down. We'll start building with this. I wonder how long of a zip line you can make. I mean, you can get it out there pretty far. So I have to do like, I could probably get another zip line. You know, like do like multiples, have them going from like one spot to another spot, then from that spot to another spot, then you know what I mean? That way we don't have to walk constantly. Hard to find the elevation.
Calvin. I give up. I, I give up trying to understand Calvin. So we're going to start the wall. Hmm. Let's see how I want to do this. So I'm going to enclose this whole area here, obviously. Um... about here. Yeah. Ish. I think it's still too. There. There we go. Yep, that's how we want it. Doesn't help that my base is a little crooked. <laughs> uh, Pokemon, thank you so Pokemon 70, thank you so much for the re-up on the membership. I appreciate you. How you doing tonight? And then we got Z. I think Virginia got tired of my crap. Uh, no, she hasn't been back in a while. We didn't even yell at her for sleeping in our in our bed. I just went and slept outside, and I built another bed. Kelvin's such a fucking overachiever, dude. He doesn't do, he doesn't do anything, and now he wants to over, be an over. Like. He's showing another helicopter crash. Yeah, I think that was the one I already went to. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, she's so useful. So how many was it? I think it was was it for the defensive wall? I think it was five. Five and one across. Seven. Seven and one across. Gotta cut the tops off first. 
Before you brace it? Yeah, okay, so you gotta cut the tops before you brace it. You guys wanted immersion. Now you're cutting all your spikes. Oh, is that to make a gate, maybe? The one across, chat? Be a lot of wall to be built here, chat. Help, but every time I see Kelvin, he just he just makes me laugh, dude. Oh yeah, th this that's why I was trying to keep my ambitions uh, small for for the for the gate because uh, I already knew it was gonna be it was gonna be quite an endeavor. Um, building this whole thing, especially single player solo. But it's all good, you know what I mean? Because once it's done, it's going to be freaking awesome. And with all the mutants and shit like that attacking, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be worth it. It's going to be worth it to have this nice gated area. And then any, if anything, we can even build on top of our, once we have this walled in, we could, we could build on top of our, uh, our platform here and then have people like have the, a way for me to shoot over the walls and shit. Man, I don't know how he even got up there. We, we don't question Calvin. He just, he just does what he does. But I mean, think about it. In real life, it would take forever to build this. You know what I mean? And I'm looking at it and I'm like, you know what? How many days in game would this take me? It's probably going to take me quite a few days. You know what I mean? At least a week in game. And that's just immersion, chat. You know? There's a watchtower in the book. One of my, you know. We'll see, we'll see we'll see how uh how this all pans out here. 
Uh, I'm, building has never been one of my strong suits in games at all. Uh, and I, I, I never claimed to be a master builder. Um, I'm pretty proud of this, to be honest with you guys. Calvin, go get more logs, dude. Stop lounging. Yeah, we, we need to have like a little fit, like a door for access, yeah, for Kelvin to go out and do some fishing. Because I was trying to think of where I want the main entrance and exit to be for the base. And I was thinking about either having it, I might have two actually, I might have it on this side. Is that man really just grabbing logs out of holders? Oh, so some of those logs I sent down the thing uh, went into the ground. Uh, chat, how do you, so how do you make a gate out of these? Is that that part where I seen putting the, the thing on the back side, is that how you make a gate? Oh, there is there is no gate. Well then we're just going to have to leave an opening for right now. I'll just put a bunch of... We'll have a bunch of traps or something. It's kind of veering a little bit. You can tell Kelvin to clear an area, certain size area, he'll chop all the trees down in that area, really? I might bring him with us when we go up there to set up that other zip line too. So the thing is, I'm going to have to rearrange this because I'm not going to build around how this is currently set up because it's a mess, um, obviously. So I'm trying to think of how I how far I actually want to come with this gate, and I was thinking maybe, maybe to where the end of this is. Uh, make a wall like the one in my house and build like a, uh, and just build a door. Uh. Well, we could do that for right now. Might want to go off. I'm just warning you. Yeah. 
Hopefully they learn from that. He's coming back. Ah! Do you want to end up like your... Way harder to get the head off, specifically. Kelvin's out of control. All right, but that's it. That's all there is to say about it. He's he's out of control. What is that? 
Bob. Oh, they look good. How big are they? How big is it? Size was. Oh shit, what did I do? Did I just make like a defensive spike? <sighs> yeah, then I just walked into it. Oh shit, chat, you could. Those weren't even in the book. At least I didn't see them. We're gonna get, we're gonna get Kelvin. Get some freaking logs, man. Holy shit! What's up, dude? Yeah, crossbow hits different, bro. Try to warn these guys, and they don't listen. Kelvin, why do you have to be so literal, bro? Trying to trying to get our new uh, lawn decorations here, chat, so they know that we're not the one. I think eventually they'll get the idea, right? Oh, uh, we got mutant baby horde passing through. We gotta get this damn wall built.
That's the main thing I'm worried about. Once we start getting sieged by like mutants consistently. Oh, there's a lot of them, chat. What? Oh, no, no. I was trying to take this apart, wasn't I? To build the uh, horizontal. Let me store these up for a sec. Kelvin just took took the fuck off. Reminds me of the botchling from uh, The Witcher. I just go around poking him with the damn spear. The yeah, babies are just one of way more mobile than they were in the first game. It's starting. Yeah, so let's see here. We're going to try to build the horizontal and we'll make a door. So it seems like there has to be a little gap here for whatever reason. He, he acts like he understands, and then he doesn't... Then he just stands there like that. Gotta get some lights out here, too, on the walls. I think because there's no logs anywhere nearby, like, the, the closest logs 
are too far away. So I'm pretty sure that's the reason why he's giving me a hard time. All right, so let's see if we can get some light going out here because it is super dark. I'm probably going to do some wall lights, like wall torches right here. Yeah, there we go. And then we'll have these scattered all throughout the, uh, the walls. Woo! Yeah, that brightened it up. Nice. We'll finish this in the morning. This little gap is annoying, but it is what it is. What we got. I don't want to connect to that. It's giving me a hard time. They'll be able to climb over it. Yeah, I don't know if I want to roll with that, though, Chad. I just feel like it's... It's a waste of seven logs. It's not very pretty. And then, like, people in the chat said, they'll just climb over it like they did these. Right, let's eat some breakfast, then we'll get, our, we'll get this figured out. Now I can't even, now that we've just seen it, we can't even, uh, build away from it. We're just gonna have to have traps. Perfect. I said it's easy to have, like, you know, we'll have our way out for water here. Um, and I could defend one entrance, you know, no problem. And that'll give us a place to focus traps and things like that, you know what I mean?
Just, yeah, we'll have the defensive spikes. We tried the vertical logs. It doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. You can't build off of it. And I'm not just going to have my whole wall be vertical logs because then they can just climb them. We want the defensive walls, that way they can't uh, climb them. And the thing is, if I want to, what I could do is I could build a vertical wall in front of this wall. You know what I mean? If I really, really wanted to do that. But the thing about these doors is they, the, 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 the cannibals, they just walk right through it. Shit, we got a finger guy out there. And doing vertical walls, um, is, it's going to be cheaper than if I do the horizontal ones, I think. Horizontal ones are... Uh, it might be the same. I had the guy uh, he didn't jump where the spikes were he jumped where the where the the wall wasn't cut yet so I don't know if they can jump over the spiked walls and if they do I'm pretty sure they're gonna take damage okay so we're almost out of logs I can't jump it. We're going to build a second zip line up here. Up on top. And uh, thank you guys for almost 1,200 likes on the stream. I really do appreciate it. Calvin, out of all the places you could have went and hung out, dude, you came out here. Okay, so let's do another zip line. And thank you for all the new subscribers to the channel, too. I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, Aaron, also, sorry I missed the super chat, brother. Uh, you got to give Kelvin a weapon, my man. He's get Yo, he doesn't take weapons. Yeah, the only one that takes weapons is... Um 
Virginia, you can't give Kelvin a weapon. I feel like each um, each person that can live with you has like their own specialty, and Kelvin is not a fighter. Do I watch uh, NHL? I don't watch NHL, no. I don't really watch any professional sports. I'm, uh, always streaming. <laughs> I'm always with you guys. When I have free time. <sighs> You know what we're gonna do too? We're gonna have Calvin go get mad sticks. Um, because we are gonna need a bunch of sticks for our uh our little walls. Let's do... So this should be a relatively easy task for him to do. He's the master stick collector, so... Try a diagonal log... ...on the fence. Yeah, well, I seen this. This is what I seen, guys, in the book. Um... And if any, anybody can, so if you look on the defensive wall right here, see where my finger's over? I don't know why my finger's covering it, but it says uh, defensive wall, you put one down, then you do the, that, then you cut them, then they're cut. Then you take another log and it shows it laying diagonally across the back. But when I walked up to my, my walls, it didn't give me the option to place anything on it. It looks double wide. Yeah, I mean, it does look double wide. Yeah, there is... Yeah, we'll, we'll mess with that later. We'll try to figure out once we get back down there. Oh, that's a corner? That would make sense, too. Yeah, that you have to have it set up in the corner.
Yeah, you would you would need to pin it up against something, so having to have it up against the corner would make sense. Shit, a whole lot of them. Come on, dudes. I'm just trying to live my life, man. grenade not kill that man or knock down a single tree uh, what kind of sports uh do my kids like uh my but my youngest son he's into hockey um my daughter, she does gymnastics. Um, and my oldest son, he's not much of a sports person. He's more of a techie guy like me. I think we might be okay. Maybe they ran off. So this is where I kind of wanted to set up the other zip line. Like, back as far as we can. We'll be able to do it, like, back this far. There we go. Right, hopefully this is not too far. From what I see, though, it should work. Perfect. Oh. And...
if you can make one long zip. Nah, they, 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 yeah, they, uh, you can only go a certain distance with the uh, zip line launcher. Uh, then the, the dot just disappears. Yo! What are you doing, bro? Is he taking my shit? Another one of those skin pouches. We got like three of them bad boys we gotta open. Oh. We're gonna get a pile of logs down here, then we're gonna command him again to uh start putting some of those away. See what we gotta deal with out here, chat? Is it... See what we gotta deal with in this forest? Bunch of savages out here. Trying to take my hard... Uh, my hard-earned cut wood. All right, let's get them chopping some more trees. So I'm gonna have like a kind of like a relay system. Um, at least that's how I envision this working. It's just the logs rolling around. You guys think the relay system will work? Have I ever done acid? <laughs> no. No, the only drug I've ever done in my entire life is, uh, I've smoked weed. Um, way back in the day. Uh, but then I held government jobs that um, yeah, I was truck driver in the military, so I... What? Oh, chat, you could send logs both ways, too. I don't think I've ever been asked that question before.
Got the crawly dudes. Grab this and get the hell out of here. I don't want to overload the zip. So it seems like when you do that, the uh... We got one of the big guys down there. Ah! Leave Calvin alone, bro. Calvin, you and that water bug, dude, you're so annoying. Alright, we're gonna switch him over to logs now. Let's get those skin pouches open really quick. There we go, Calvin. There we go. Yeah, so the relay system works pretty decent. I wonder if there's a limit to the amount of zip lines you can have on the map. Or if we could just have these sun guns all over the island. Would you eat food stored in a skin pouch? Um, I mean, it depends on how hungry I am and how dried out that skin pouch is. If it's if it's still pretty moist, I don't know, man. That, that would be rough. But also, if the if, if if it's wrapped like that candy bar was wrapped, you know. That's not too bad. I might be able to deal with it being wrapped. But now if it's like a free piece of meat, like imagine like a chicken nugget, like a loose ass chicken nugget, just in a skin pouch. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I f would feel about that. I mean, would any of you guys eat a loose nugget? I don't think I would eat one that was just, period. Like, I don't think I could eat a loose nugget just sitting on a table or something. Like, if you just walked up to, like, a picnic table and there was just a fucking nugget sitting there, like, I don't think I would just be able to eat it. You don't know where that nugget's been. <laughs> Rogue Nugget. <laughs> they, hey, man, they they do go they do go rogue, man. Have you seen my kids? I got my car detailed before, and the guy was like, "Listen, dude." 
I found about 20 large fries and three 20 piece nuggets in your back seat. And I'm like, I, I get it, dude. And I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what it's like having kids, little kids. Can't carry any more skin pouches, unfortunately. But then it won't let me open any more skin pouches either. Let me see. I wish you could store the candy bars on the freaking shelf, but I don't think you can. Oh, you could store the skin pouches. Oh, chat. I'm such an idiot. Yo, there's mad stuff you could. So you guys weren't lying. Oh, man. You could store everything. Yeah, <laughs> see, those of you guys with kids, you understand what it's like. Guys, you can store everything. I messed up. I thought you could only store the food. Oh. Yeah, you, you could cycle through here. You could store air tanks, extra tarps. I can store the sodas. I can store the energy bars, meds. Oh, man, we're about to be shelping it up, dude. Bombs, grenades, flares. Yeah, you, we're, we're going to be rearranging some stuff here. Probably gonna move these bones outside at some point, and then we're gonna just have the wall with shelves. Oh man. All right. Well, the reason why I was I was trying to empty everything out so I can open these skin pouches. Pretty tired. So we just discovered more awesomeness. And you add to a table. Um, I don't... So, I, I built the table because I was going to put stuff on it. But now I actually think I'm going to get rid of the table and just build more shelves. You know what I mean? So there really is no purpose. Like, I could put stuff on the table like holders. But um, you can't really build any storage on the table. So, that's why I think I'm going to move these bone racks outside. Take a break, brother. Okay. I mean, we made some decent progress on logs today. 
We did get attacked twice, so. Um, you know what? While we're waiting for this, let's, let's move these bones right now. Work on the inside a little bit. So we'll build the bone storages out here. I got a lot of bone. You know what we're going to do here? It's going to be beautiful. Are you ready for this chat? I'm going to go furniture. We'll do a wall torch here on the side of the house, too. Boom! Get it nice and lit up. Once we get the wall done, too, we're going to have it going all around the, around the wall. That way we'll be able to see nice. Thing is, it doesn't seem like we've been uh, getting attacked all that much at night. I mean, mainly attacking us during the day, right when I could see. Probably do another one of those. Uh, I think I'm out of skulls, though. Yeah. I have skulls for days, and then I'm like, ah, oh, the skulls are so pointless. And now I'm like, damn, I need skulls. Take these apart. Whoop. Shot my damn floor. Whoop. How the hell did I do that? You son of a gun. Uh, I think we can use these for the shelves, though. the hatchet or this thing never use the axe you can't hold yeah I, I when I held C um, it just put the bone in the thing so now I gotta take that one out and take that one out it's all good we, we can use those for shelves anyways I'll chop one log in half. We'll have the floor fixed. It's all good. Like it never happened.
Let me build these ones out, and then I'll fix the other ones. You hold four of these little ones. Seriously. Do that. Um, so we'll keep that stuff on us for right now. Some printer resin on here. Uh, maybe we should do some of our. Yeah, we'll do these C4 blocks because. these other shelves. See, chat, we're doing it. I'm gonna take this top one apart, too, once we get the... so I can rearrange them. I could just chop this one here. Uh, Steven with the membership. Welcome, welcome to the family. You know why the cannibals carry purses? Because they don't have pockets, man. Yeah, they, they don't got no pockets. Wire, vodka, cloth, feathers, zip lines, rope. Another one we'll store up. And... Get some sleep. Yeah, see, I can't take this shelf apart.
Whoops. Might just be stuck with the shelving looking like that, guys. I am, I'm hitting C. It doesn't... It doesn't do it. Nope, it just wants to take that apart. You know what I noticed? No matter what time you go to sleep, you'll always wake up at like 7.30. So now we got two mutants out in that field. I'm not feeling very comfortable about this chat. And it's taking forever for us to get this damn wall constructed. Take what we have right now and do what we can, but... I think that's good. We're gonna have to hunt these suckers down right here. We're gonna come for our bed. For our, our bed, our base. We just gotta remember, after any attacks, we gotta go back around our walls, especially if they were... and repair them. Alright, yeah, they're getting a little close. Let's go deal with this dude. Oh shit, you, I shot him in the knee and it dropped him. Oh man, yo, the shots to the leg, guys. I think you could do the same thing with the cannibals too, though. Can't you shoot them in the leg and they like start like hobbling and shit? I think I straightened. Oh, I hit the other arrow. What? There's no way out. My aim was that good, chat. I hit the other arrow. <laughs> See? Our aim was that god tier.
Is Virginia st Yeah, she's still in the same spot, actually. Up near that freaking helicopter crash. She really wants me to go over there. Well, there's that skin pouch. So this stuff, we're going to have to obviously rearrange. He's pointing at something. What is there more guys out there, dude? So, first things first. Go store these tarps. Okay, so we're gonna move... Yeah, yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll get this. We're going to do some more of these over here. Wonder why I can't put this here. Might be too close to the corner. This must have been what he was pointing at. That was a straight miss. Yo, I shot another arrow into an arrow, dude. What is up with that? Now, really quickly, let me uh, get this out. I want to check that corner thing that we were just all talking about. <sighs> so let me cut the defensive wall bits. And uh, thank you guys for over 1,300 likes on the stream. I really appreciate it. Just cut up like this. And then I'm going to try to see about putting that piece in the corner. If that's what it, if it was referring, what it was referring to.
Still don't see it, guys. Well, maybe it's because I have two. Only thing I could do there is double it up. So I, I don't know what that uh, picture is referring to then. Oh no, well I guess we could eat, doesn't matter. Might might be a smaller log piece yet, yeah, like a, like a half. We'll worry about it later on. I don't want to waste uh, cutting a log up right now. getting there guys we are getting there we got about i don't know maybe a third of the wall because i'm only gonna have it come to about here right and then it's gonna go down this way and then uh connect to there so that will be the you know perimeter and then we're just gonna rearrange all the stuff that we have all like our rock storages and shit, you know, we'll, we can rearrange that over here. The log storages, that can all stay outside the, the walls. It doesn't need to be inside. Finish off these bit of logs that we have on us right now. So today was a bit of a mix. Every last episode, I, I went real hard on. Um, we went really, really hard on cave exploration. We did a good bit of exploration today too. Uh, followed up by a good bit of base building, but this needed to happen. You know what I mean? I was. Kind of slacking on the base. Rags with the raid. Thank you so much, brother. I really appreciate that, man. Uh, yeah, so it's only going to have one entrance. Um, that way I can funnel all the baddies uh, into the base uh, in a specific direction. Uh, and that way I can put traps out there. I'm obviously going to... We're going to do stick traps, uh, the, the, the spikes, all around the perimeter of the base. And then... Uh, my plan for the entrance here is I'm kind of do I'm gonna do like a serpentine of spike traps facing outward. That way, when they come, they gotta kind of zigzag between the spike traps to get inside, and then I'll also have normal traps out there too. So that way, this is the only way in, and they're gonna want to funnel to this because it's the only way in. Um, and then, like I said, we'll have a serpentine of the, the, the spikes actually stabbing out the ground. And we'll also have traps 
uh, late around. Plus, we'll have, you know, tons of of the heads and shit like that out here to try to deter them from coming. That's my plan, at least. We'll see if it works. We'll see if it works. But yeah, we're gonna have the spikes all around um, the base to try to make sure we funnel them in that way. They can climb, but can they climb over the spike walls? I thought the point of the spike walls was for them to not be able to climb over them. Or to at least die trying. So that has to go over how many... Let's see. Let's look at that. They probably... Probably like another five logs. It'd be good. Winter's come. Oh, shit. Yeah, the fall is already setting in. So that is one thing. It, on my second playthrough of this game, um, I'm definitely going to change the season length. So I would like the seasons to be a bit longer. So that that's the plan, guys. We got... A decent bit of the wall done today. Like I said, I'm happy with it. Uh, and then once we get the wall done, then we'll focus on expanding the actual base itself, building it up a little bit. So there's that. But, hey, I, I really appreciate all the love, all the support that you guys have been showing this series. We've got almost 1,400 likes on this stream. Um, I really appreciate that. We're going to end this here, um, and then next episode we'll, we'll pick up. I might do another episode tomorrow. We'll, we'll just kind of have to see. Uh, but I, I do appreciate all the support, guys. All the new subscribers. Uh, you guys really showing some love. So I'll be doing another stream here in a little bit. I'm going to eat dinner, and then I'll be playing some ARC here in a little bit. So I uh, hope I'll see a bunch of you guys over there. Remember, if you have it on your way out, hey, smash that like button if you guys are enjoying the content. Frags again with the raid, brother. I appreciate you, man. Um, and uh, if you guys are new to the channel, hey, consider subscribing. It really helps out. And uh, yeah, other than that, you, if I don't see you guys later, you have a great rest of your night. And for everybody else, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.